In this video, let's learn how to create an EPUB file. EPUB file is also called as electronic publishing file. So using this EPUB, you can actually export a document, a page or a book in the form of a EPUB file, which is a ebook and also called as EPUB file. Now EPUB files are compatible with Adobe Digital Reader software. Steps are given here and let us see how do we do it practically. Now let us see how to create the EPUB files practically. So first let us click on the document digital publishing and then choose it as A4 portrait orientation. How many number of pages that you want you can choose or just click OK so that you will have the pages directly here. So now in this what I would like to do is in the very first page I would like to create a, the cover page. So just take a frame control D you can insert any image right click fit yes you can actually create a cover page and uh, now after that in the second page or in the same page let us give the text Lion King select the text color centralize it put it here on top and right click fitting this is what we have written in the first page in the second page let us leave it for TOC. In the third page I would like to create some frame and then give the image and uh, write the text. Write the text in this. Uh, let's say we will fill with placeholder text and uh, in this one we'll write chapter one increase the size double click on it select all and then paragraph styles write heading one that's it and in the second page I'll just copy this chapter 2 fill with placeholder text yes and then this one also apply it as heading 1 so now we have page 1 and page 2 and in this table of contents I'd like to go to table style if you wanted to create any style you can actually click new and then create a new style new style will name it as uh, TP as tutorial points and uh, uh, what is that we have to use is heading one so select this one inside this insert this heading one into the table of contents that is include paragraph styles so here uh, sort entries I don't want to just enter it uh, remove that and put it as level 2 and uh, page number no page number if you don't want to put any page number just give it as no page number so entry style as heading 1 and that's it so just click OK and uh, just click OK and from here create table of contents is there and uh, when you click OK you can actually insert it as chapter 1 and chapter 2 now later after inserting this one in the table of contents uh, just go back and verify it go to file export on the desktop create ePub and then uh, click save 
and then here it is asking for version so you need to use this first page or rasterize first page that means it is making it as image so that the content should not come down uh, content order based on page layout uh, let it be like that and uh, see that view epub after exporting is highlighted in the image if you wanted to maintain any resolution we can maintain in the advanced there's nothing here if you wanted to include the publisher you can just write the publisher name so here it is tutorials point and uh, if you don't want to split the document uh, based on paragraph as heading one and uh, add the style sheet so we don't have any style sheet just click OK and then now when you see this uh, it is coming in the Adobe Digital Edition because I already told you that EPUB files has to be viewed only in uh, the Adobe Digital Edition software so now you can see uh, once if you move it chapter 1 and chapter 2 and we have the text and we have the images so this is how we can actually export the EPUB files cancel that's it about this video